We're getting a double cold start. We're doing the Civic 2 now. Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. As you guys can see, we got the turbo truck right here back on the page. So this is probably a video that um, a lot of you have been waiting for and um, have been more curious about the setup since I only made like one video on it. But uh, this is the video where we're gonna go through everything and like the plans on it. So let's get started. For the interior, let's start with obviously the uh, motion motion race work steering wheel with the uh, buttons. Uh, the top button is the uh, the two step. The bottom one, we're still not sure. We're trying to probably gonna do any rolling lag or the uh, a scramble button. And these buttons, I don't know what the fuck. But <clears throat> anyways, let's get more inside. So as you guys can see right here, tablet. Here, let me take this camera off and it's also quick release as well we have a holly efi system we have the uh the terminator x and uh we have the uh little seven inch screen on here as you guys can see and um yeah we got our fuel pressure boost uh battery voltages and then we have the miles per hour you know all that's bullshit and um yeah and we have a little sound system right here. We got the little screen right here. Uh, tells us like more stuff that we need to know. And uh, yeah, what else is there? I think you guys are mainly here for the uh, more of the bigger performance stuff. More of the what makes your car faster. I mean, this is a big safety feature, the uh, Holly. But uh, yeah, let's pop the hood. Now nah, I'm gonna keep blue balling you guys. So. We got for the wheels. We got the uh, Weld Weld Racing S seventy sevens, the seventeen by five and a half, I believe, with some Mickey Thompson tires, as you guys can see. And then for the rear, we got some fifteen by ten, I believe, um, Weld Racing S seventy seven as well. But the bead locks on a Hooser tire. This is a uh, twenty nine point five ten five fifteen. So, you guys can see how meaty that is right there. Uh, let's see the poke back here. Then, um, for the uh, diff gears, we got um, the True Track gears. So, it's like LSD pretty much, I guess. But, yeah, let's get to the, uh, the good part now. Alright, so I think this is what everyone's here for mainly. What's done under the hood. So to begin with, we have an LQ460 LS block, stock bottom end. And then for the heads, we got 823 heads, I believe, with um, obviously a built, they're built. And then um, Holly High Ram, the, as you guys can see. And then we got a 92 millimeter uh, Nick Williams throttle body on here to, uh, you know, more steam out. Let's see what other major things. And then for the turbo, it's a VS Racing 78, 75 mil turbo. It's a Huron Speed uh, turbo kit. As you guys could, I don't know if it says here somewhere, but uh, you can see the intercooler right there. And uh, we got it all fancied up with the powder coating. You guys can see right here. And um, what else? We got a Morso coolant catch or a coolant resonator reservator. Ugh. You guys know what I mean. This is off of a Mustang. Forgot what year. We got our catch can set up over there. If it loads up, there you go. What else? What else? Um, it's pretty much it. It's a simple setup. The truck's currently not fully tuned. It's um, it's on a base tune right now, but we still been doing little pulls every here every now and then. Um, we still have uh, we got over here. We have a stage two MP transmission. Uh. 40 lady and then over here we got the uh, circle D uh, What's this shit called again torque converter and um what else? It's pretty much it. There's still a lot of things we got to do before we fully get it tuned a lot of very minor things uh, We got the trans cooler right here. We do have an upgraded one here. I'll pull that out in a second 
We got one of these suckers, the derails um, trans cooler, more badass unit for the uh, for the truck. So that should help, like with the trans cooling temps, a bit more better, way much more better, hopefully. And um, yeah, so we're gonna be doing a quick few pulls, uh, little revs, so you guys could uh, see how it sounds or hear how it sounds. And um, yeah, let's get to it. All right, guys. So we're on a quick dip in the truck. Yeah, we're we'll doing a little pull right here. Right here. Let's, let's hear the blow up out. Nah, tell me that does not scream freedom, brother. Yeet! Anyways, let's get back to the driving. This thing is a trooper, I'll tell you that much. So all my taquachas watching, I hope you guys are enjoying this video. Even if you aren't one, hope you're still enjoying this. Shout out to my taquachas, dog. But uh, yeah, this thing, this thing sounds good. Right now it's not pulling crazy. Tires need to warm up a little. But yeah, we'll do a quick another one right here. We'll wait a, we'll just wait a little bit. Sounds good. The, the sounds and everything makes up for it, so it ain't no biggie. Alright, hope everyone liked those few clips of me doing the polls. Um, you know, something little, just a little, little bit of sauce. Can't go too crazy on it, obviously. But uh, yeah, the trucks. The truck's doing very well right now. Um, I'll give you guys a few revs right now if you guys want. Well, I'm gonna do it anyways, but we're gonna do a few revs. Nothing crazy, cause where we're at, don't wanna cost too much of an issue. And then we're gonna call the uh, the video an end, guys. So let me put you guys down and then do a quick few revs. Just like that that's gonna be it um i will do a few more other videos later on doing little drive-bys a better video of me doing the polls and all that um that's gonna conclude for today's video uh we will be doing more content on the truck obviously i know some of you are mainly here for the truck not the civic or crv so i'm gonna try to deliver you guys that all that content but one last time let's see let's look at the interior looks good but yeah hope you guys are enjoying everything like comment subscribe uh comment i don't know comment what you guys are mainly here for but uh yeah have a good one guys